Inspector Buchanan. What is it, McTavish? Uh, this just came in from Interpol. Or hard to lock the door in you. Rach locking your knee. Do you realize that Harry Nine Lives is in London? Harry Nine Lives, the cat burglar? Hey, Harry Nine Lives, the most wanted criminal in the world. I wonder what he's up to, the new. Nine Lives has battled the finest minds of the FBI and Interpol, whoever they are. Buzz, not yet cross paths with me, Inspector Buchanan. Aye. It should be the most baffling and challenging battle of wits. The world's greatest detective versus the world's greatest cat burglar. Stolen, the most precious cat in my collection. Oh, dear, dear, dear. I can't stand to see a woman cry. Oh, oh, dear. Uh, 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 that's better. <clears throat> now tell me, madam, was the wee pussy insured? Only the collision. Oh. Have you got a wee footy of the pussy? Yes, dear. Yes, yes. yes sweet. <laughs> oh, it's exquisite. <laughs> exquisite. What vicious criminal could have done a thing like that? A little something for you, my sweet. Oh, oh Harry, it's magnificent. Put it on me. <laughs> Oh, it's positively dazzling. Is it real? All as real as you are, my sweet. Uh, tell me, Harry, what made you become a cat burglar? Well, when I was but a poor urchin, the rich little girl next door had a cat. Oh, so beautiful. Little pointed ears, eyes that glowed in the dark. How sweet and playful she was. How she used to purr when I would tickle and stroke her. The cat was very nice, too. <laughs> to us, Harry. To us. <laughs> this is Ian Wondergaard, your BBC Roman reporter. The rash of cat burglaries by the inf infamous Harry Nine Lives continues. Last night alone, 38 cats and a pussy willow bush were stolen. <laughs> Let's find out how the citizens of London are reacting to this crime wave. You, sir. You, sir. What do you think about cats disappearing? Personally, I think Mrs. Katz is better off without him. Well, here uh, with me now is the father of Harry Nine Lives. Tell me, Mr. Nine Lives, was there anything in your son's childhood to suggest that he would grow up to be a notorious cat burglar? No, he was just a normal boy from a normal family. Can't understand it. I suppose you're wondering why I've asked you here. Well, I'll tell you. All three of you are named Harry Nine Lives, but only one of you is Harry Nine Lives, a cat burglar, eh? Now then, will the real Harry Nine Lives please stand up? <laughs> hmm? You see, Inspector, I told you it wouldn't work. You're right, Mr. Nine Lives. You're very clever, but you're no clever enough. I may not know yet which of you three is a cat burglar, but in time I shall find out, eh? <laughs> I shall observe your every move. <laughs> by night and by day, you'll be under constant scrutiny. I will observe you until someday, somehow, somewhere, you will make one tiny mistake. One little slip, and you'll give yourself away. Eh? You can count on it. I'll find you out. One day you'll leave a little pool, a small pool somewhere, pool of water, something or other. Some little thing which might mean nothing to the untrained observer. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But to me, Inspector Buchanan, it'll point out clearly and unmistakably which one of you is a criminal. I am watching you, Harry Nine Lives, whoever you are. And you take my word for it, sooner or later, you are going to give yourself away. Yes. You watch out, Harry Nine Lives, I'm watching you. Yes, yes. 
They always do give themselves a wee bit of... Hey. Caution, Inspector. It might be a trick. Don't worry, I can deal with that. Goodbye, darling. Oh, oh, just a little token of my appreciation. Oh, thank you. And here's your change. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I believe it's your move, sir. are <laughs> nine lives. You are under Scottish arrest. What's the meaning of this? Huh? You thought you could escape Scottish justice, didn't you? But I've never given up hope of catching you. I've searched the world, all over the world for you, and I've tracked you down at last. You are my prisoner. And let the world note that no man shall go free. Well, Inspector Buchanan lives. Oh, it's time for my heart attack. <laughs> oh. 